What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will from the What's Up in the Sky 37 channel online at www.whatsupinthesky.com and welcome to my 300 Martian video. This one's getting a tag number 300. Now I've got about 500 some videos. So I know there's more Mars videos than 300 but these are just the tagged ones. Um, this is the, a picture from the Opportunity Rover, one that's been around the internet. I didn't find this one, but one that's fascinated me for a really, really long time because these perfectly shaped um, whatever they are, are just out. This is the Victoria Crater here, and here's a shot. They're just almost perfectly lined up out here, and we're going to show you exactly. This is saw number 10. Here's where we get it from. This is saw 1070. I'm going to have this all linked up. All you have to do is just download it. You can see these little two little things in the background of it, too. It's pretty amazing. And what I've done is I came and I took the... Uh, this here, you can get it. Let me show you guys. This is the basically the saws from the Opportunity River, where it was when it took this. And this is the Victoria Crater. Now, saw 1069 was here. So 1070 was right about here as well. And we're going to go ahead and find that on here. Here's the big piece. Uh, basically right about here is where the river was. So if out in the distance, we'd be looking out this way and that way. Um, for these and they look a little bit far off and you don't see anything that would to me I don't see anything out here that would show it, anything that's dark anything that's perfectly spaced out just some rock debris some stuff around here now this is the same area that had the uh, the Egyptian if you watch my videos the Egyptians on Mars it has that really neat statue this this crater here this whole little area is pretty awesome um, so let's go back take a look at it now so you saw where we got it from you can download it. all you have to do is go to the description now let's take a uh, a better look at this what i've done also like right here uh, there's just in the foreground there's some interesting things but i mean this almost looks like a a, a tank brigade coming in or something or or some tanks or something that uh, like uh, like water tanks or ballast some sort of tanks fuel tanks that have been sitting out there now what I want to do is see okay let's see how you know how are these things really that spaced out perfect and what I figured we'd do here and we're kind of on an angle looking at it so it's not going to be exact this isn't science here but you can see from the middle to the middle <laughs> that's pretty dead on look at that one two I hope you guys can see this uh Maybe if I, yeah, there we go. Hopefully you can see this even better now. Center to center on these. Perfect. Almost perfect here. And the fact that they would even be like that is pretty amazing because it's, it, you know, we're not on the exact same path. Now let's start over here. Okay, that would have been there. Perfect. Okay. A little bit different. So the, fir the first couple, well, here we go. Starting right there. That's where, we're, that's where we get it. So let me back. So, you know, and these things here actually look a little bit different than these pieces over here. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of them. Let's see if they all line up perfect. All right. So we take it from the first one to the second. That's pretty good from my standpoint from here. There's another one right there. Pretty good from my standpoint. And we have another one. Another match. What in the world is this stuff, guys? This is one of my favorites. I've, I haven't had an explanation for that. And I've looked, like I said, I don't think this is, this isn't part of any, the rover. This, this isn't part of the, the bags. They brought it down. These things are evenly spaced out. Um, and they're there, and it's what's neat about it is there's nothing really around this whole area. It's just flat, and you can see it's just flat because these pictures don't lie. I mean, it's, it's pretty darn flat. It looks like the uh, the crater just comes out of nowhere. Um, it's a very interesting stuff right in these areas right here, especially if you get the uh, pictures from that rover from Opportunity. But what do you guys think? This is one of the ones that uh, have always boggled my mind. Let's get these things in real close and see if we can take just a, a gander at them, if there's anything that, that would show what they could be. They're shaped in the same way. I mean, see how they come up? They've got... They go up and over. 
They're a little bit fatter on the left side, and they're all the well, yeah, they're all the same. They're all a little bit fatter on this left side, and some of they all seem to have uh, something under it as well. Uh, let me see if I go back to the original NASA, and make sure I didn't add that. No, you see those. Whatever's under it's there as well too, and uh, you can seem to see a little. Pretty amazing, whatever's going on here. Um, what do we have here? A little brigade. This is a tank brigade coming up to see. <laughs> coming up to see. Now let's take a look at the foreground here as well, because there's some interesting circles and the whole uh, Victoria Crater is just beautiful. It's some amazing stuff in it. Now, I know the rover didn't wouldn't play around on these tracks. So who made these tracks right here? Check these out. Comes up and it turns. The the rover definitely didn't descend off of the. Uh, off of the side of the cliff here, they they stayed on the edge of this as it went around it at Vern Point. I think that was the first one called something along those lines. Look down in here. Is it the most uh, amazing quality ever in a picture? But you can see something down here that's sitting up. Almost it looks like pretty pretty well cut pieces. Uh, does nature make this right here <laughs> and then ha you know expect us to think that this was something that nature made i'm not sure i hope you guys enjoy the 300th video i hope you share this like it guys i wouldn't make these videos if it weren't for you there's so many trolls out here and everything it's uh it, it's having a blast uh doing this and we just like I said, this is one of the ones I've been wanting to cover forever. There's still hundreds of videos that uh, I've got to make just from the known anomalies. So I'm not going to be going anywhere. We've been doing this for a long time. Look at these. You see what I'm seeing here? This piece right here has something coming up and down out of it. Um, now let's take that right there. Let me single this out and then we'll just take a look at this really fast. Because you know how we don't want to leave any anomaly not turned over let's see no no anomalies unturned all right exposure what in the world is going on here all right let me give you some of that gamma correction i just want to get the just trying to really see the edges of it i don't know guys what do you think pretty interesting whatever it is not what if anything out of this picture this stuff is just a minuscule to whatever is out here on the horizon. Um, I love to hear what you guys think. Comment below. Hit share. Facebook. When you guys hit share on send this stuff out on Facebook, you don't even understand how much it helps. It, it really does help get this stuff out. There's so many people. Twitter, Google+, all of it works for us. Uh, much love to you. Hope you're having a good one. Take it easy. Peace.